I chose to become an air traffic controller because I, I honestly thought it was the best break for the Navy. Well, I thought it was the best option for me when I was in MEPS. I had uh, three other races to choose from and air traffic control seemed to be uh, uh, the best fit for me at the time. We're responsible for the safe and uh, expeditious movement of aircraft. Um, on the USS Nimitz, we make sure they land safely and uh, take off safely. Uh, we're responsible for traffic separation, make sure that aircraft don't uh, uh, collide into each other. We're responsible for uh, their fuel states, making sure they have uh, enough fuel. 600 left of the final bearing, Super 9. 305 light of the final bearing, 327. What is the worst possible thing that could happen? Well, I think it's uh, the collision of aircraft in mid-flight. Uh, and that is what we try to prevent all the time as air traffic controllers. The possibilities are endless. <laughs> all right, um, I can work for, uh, for the FAA. I can work for any, uh, any uh, regional or international air traffic control facility. I can, I can be a civilian contractor for the military. So there's a lot of possibilities for me out there as a civilian. I think uh, ultimately it comes down to all the characters in my division. Uh, everybody's really fun to hang out with. Uh, everybody's really cool. Everybody uh, brings something uh, special to the table. Um, everybody's funny. I like this division. This is awesome. This is the best rate. I know this is the only rate I've uh, ever been in, but I like it a lot. And uh, for all undesignated airmen and seamen, I would advise you to strike AC. <laughs>